Hey, this is Jonathan, and I'm just going to show you something cool that I built. Um, it's an Altoid USB charger. It can basically charge like anything USB, like your phone or iPod or iPhone or any of that. Um, I have successfully charged both my phone and my iPhone. And so, yeah, I'll open it up and show you. So, here's the inside. These are some nice batteries I got from Tenergy. They are rated, or they, they say that they are 200 mAh, which is quite a bit. Um, yeah, they're, they're pretty packed in there. Um, that's basically all the wiring and stuff, and I hot glued it in there pretty well. Um, if you look at the side, you can see that there is a USB that you plug stuff in. Sorry, the cutting's pretty bad. Um, and there's the switch and the light that tells you whether it's on or off. Um, you just flip the switch and the light turns on. Turned off. Um, I'll show you it charge my phone, which is right here. Um, here, I'll get it hooked up. Okay, so as you can see, it's plugged in. But it isn't charging yet because I haven't flipped it on. And so I turned on. It's charging. Oh, I got a new message, but if you look right there, you can see that it's charging. Just pretty sweet. So it can do this for quite a bit. That battery right there on that phone says that it is a um, 900 mAh. And so if each one of these batteries is 2,000 mAh, and there are four of them, that's 8,000. So that could potentially charge my phone over eight times. And I, I'm pretty sure the iPod has a battery around 2,000 mAh, and so it could charge it maybe four times. Um, so yeah, this thing's got quite a bit of juice in it, and it's a pretty nice thing. Yeah, so that's that. Um, make sure you use chargeable batteries. That's what I'm using or else it'll have too strong of a voltage. So, yep. There it is.